there's Mr. Funny down there. Trying to break his carburetor again. It's the third carburetor that's been on this bike in less than two weeks. Technically, only the body's different. <laughs> All the other parts are the same, so that's, I will give it two and a half carburetor. Okay. <laughs> Just use a screwdriver. That'd be too easy. Did you get a throttle cable looked up? No, I was going to do that last. Why don't you do it first when you got access to the carbonator? Because I have to take the cable off to put it in there. I don't know why you'd have to do that. If the carbon's hanging over here, you could just put it in there. I don't know. This is just how I do it. The hard way. He likes working hard. Maybe you want to know if I had a sweater on because it looks like crap outside. I was wondering if you should This wear is this. called summertime in San Diego. Otherwise known as June gloom. You can't see nothing. You move your hand out of the way, sir. We can't see nothing with your stupid hand in the way. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I don't see no cable being on the end of that carbonator. <laughs> I'm trying to put it in there. Oh, is that what you're doing? Yeah, it would have been a lot easier, I guess, if I did it first, but... Yeah, if you pull the carburetor off, it'd be quicker and easier. I'd just pull the carburetor off. Okay, I'll do that. It'd be a lot easier. Some people just like to fight, 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 instead of doing it the easy way. Also wasn't... I need that too. I wasn't sure if uh, we were going to keep this on here. We don't know yet. Have to take it off again. Well, you might have to take it off again. Fun over there? I am. I always have fun when I come here. Yeah. Me too. <laughs> uh. Could be working on my truck. Oh, Maybe. is that what you were planning to do today? Hell no. <laughs> no way. Well, I was not planning to do this either today. This is a work day. We work on real important stuff on work day. Oh. Okay. All right. Don't scratch the darn truck. Look, you almost got that rust spot cleaned off. <laughs> I think your rust spot cleaned me off. No, it's okay. Where's your cable at? Right here. Where's your washer at? Down here. Where's your cutter key at? Here too. Okay, not the old one, the new one. Yes. Okay. See, I have to take it out. No, you just have to lay it down here. Just twist it around. Where's it at? It's here. I'll bring it down. Right in there. Yeah, I know it's a three-handed job. Okay, it goes in a lot easier than the other one. This way or the other way? This way. Oh, no, 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 I mean in the other uh, hole. Oh. A lot oh, this one must be squeezed up in a chrome or something on it. Yeah, it took all the paint off. Oh, that was it. Okay, a nice new cotter key. We're not going to bend it yet, are we? Oh, maybe. Slightly, one little. Just enough so it doesn't fall off would be nice. Okay, there it is. Now I'm going to put it all that. back. It's almost like you knew what he was doing over there. Look at that. <laughs> the easy way. Jeez. Uh, not really. If I didn't do it the... Did you put it on backwards or forward? I put it on the way that it goes in. It has to turn 180 around then, right? The screw has to be on this side. Oh, sh Yeah, that's that's it. That's correct. Okay, good. Good deal. Ah. There's only one way it goes in now. It's attacking you right there. Okay, where's your bolts at? I'm trying to get them in. Line up the gasket. Get in there. Okay, I'm in. Oop. Where'd the gasket go? It's uh, going to run away. I think it fell on. Where you go? Where you want it? Okay, I pushed it in now. Put the bolt in. Nobody said linkage were easy to assemble on the vehicles. They're easy to work on, but they're hard as. More like stinkert. They hard to work on on a vehicle though. Ah. There's not much space in there. Yeah, it's pan heads are more restrictive. 
more space though than like a shovel head though or iron head. No, there's these are pretty restrictive motors. Oh really? Yeah, because it sits in between the cylinders. Everything else sits on the outside. Oh well, where else would it go? Further out. Oh, because on the other two bikes, the manifold is smaller, but... It's way on the inside, three inches in, so the carburetor, yeah. the carburetor sticks in real nice on these bikes instead of being way out here. That's why on the other bikes... See, a regular bike, instead of being here, it's way the hell out here. Yep. That's what's nice about it, though, when you're riding. Yes. It's like it was made to be ridden. Yeah. If you don't lose that bolt, you might need it. Uh, keep losing that bolt. What do you keep dropping the bolt for? <laughs> it doesn't want to go in. It's supposed to go in the hole. There you go. I know you can figure it out. Now you know you got to get a choke uh, mechanism for this now. I'm sorry? We need a choke mechanism. So if anybody's got a choke mechanism they're not using that, you want to get rid of He needs one. Here, look up. He needs one. <laughs> so, you don't even have a motor mount on that bike, do you? Yeah, I do. You got the one with a dingy dong hanging down or not? A ding dong? And that means no, you have a shovel head mount. So you need a top motor mount too. It's fine, it works. Not if you have the darn choke lever, it won't. Yeah, see, so he has a shovel head top motor mount. He, need, he needs a padded motor mount to go along with a pan head throttle mechanism, choke mechanism. So you need two things. I need more than two things. Yeah, well. We don't want to get into your personal issues. <laughs> my bike is my personal issue. That's yeah. my only personal issue. Easy are. Yep. Yeah, I could have been working this whole time instead of yakking on the phone. I wasn't trying to get your help. I was trying to figure it out. You came out here, asked me what I was doing, You're making all that noise. You were over there banging and farting and dying. <laughs> and after about 20 minutes of that, I get tired of listening to it. <laughs> And I knew you were doing something screwed up, so I had to come out and fix it. This is hard to do with one hand here. Yes. I need a finger to hold the nut on so I can rotate it. How much easier it is when you have two fingers instead of just one? Mm hmm. I even got a, a wrench. Look at that. Wow. You need it <clears> so much easier when you have this style bracket than the older ones. The other bracket was in the front of this. Oh, why did they do that? Because that's how they were made. But that's not the stock bracket then? This is a stock 50 style bracket, not a 40 style bracket. Oh. So they got smart and decided to make it easier they to work on. They made it easier to work on, yes. They, wow, they thank figured, you. They figured it out. Thank you, Harley. Yeah, they, it took them a while, but they did figure that About out. Ten years. <laughs> it was probably a couple mechanics that were bending the brackets to make it easier to use. And uh, breaking them. And Harley saw it. Ooh, look at that. We're gonna patent that. That actually wasn't a bad idea. Yeah, surprised that damn grease monkey figured that out on his own. So he was an engineer and all that. See, so you tighten this up? With two wrenches going the same way. Like that. With one hand. So you do that. So one hand, two fingers. Okay. Does throttle work? It does. Open up the can see. It's all the way. Open. Oh, look at that. Okay, we need some gas. Alright, gas. Yes. Retard the ignition time a little bit. Yes, on. Just a little bit. Bucket, move. Yeah, bike is warmed up, so we're gonna move go beaker. We go in here and raise the idle speed up a little bit. Try it. Do you yeah. want me touching the throttle or not? Nope. Three kicks. One, two, three. I smell the gas now. I don't see the gas. So is there any gas in there? Uh -huh. Maybe. It looks slightly wet. If you look on the carburetor, up, can you see more? Is there any gas in there? Is there any gas floating down in the inside of that? Can't tell. No, it's a little wet. A little wet? Yeah. Not very wet, though. Just a little wet. Yes. Okay, we give it half throttle this time. Half choke. Three quarter, half choke. That's half choke right there. <clears throat> That's three quarter up another notch. Ignition on. Okay, yeah, ignition would help. Okay, ignition on. Kick. A little throttle. Throttle, is, throttle. throttle is hooked, so. Oh, you broke it. <laughs>
I'm sure I'm going to need to. It uh, ain't happy with the air going in. It's still crappy on top, but the it gets worse as you close this up. But I'm making half turn increments, which is huge. You know, it's night and day differences. But you, when you put the air cleaner on here and like, things flow in there like they're supposed to, it'll it'll breathe better. All better. right, that's the next test then, right? Yeah. So you'll probably lean this thing out about three quarters of a turn to a turn. Okay. Once we get everything hooked up, but probably about three quarters of a turn will lean out. So it's happier than it was, but it's not happy okay, yet. Okay. Now I'll go ahead and start it up. It should start with just a, a little light kick and barely, probably no throttle will probably start too. But I think it's still tight. Okay. Gas is still on, isn't it? Gas is on. That was full throttle? No throttle. Oh, no throttle. Yeah. Is that why it was idling? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they start a lot easier after you adjust them. So, uh... Okay, so that was the issue as we were cutting the fuel flow off to our low and intermediate circuit when we uh, plugged up that hole, or when I plugged up that hole. I was screwing it up. I'm the one that screwed that one all up. Okay, where's your carbonator? Air right cleaner there. at. Here's the rest of the parts at. In the box. So you're using some stupid ass screws right here yeah. with no locking devices on it at all. I blame V-Twin. And you think that's not going to fall in the hole? Wow, what would they give you for hardware? Nothing. Oh, poor thing. <laughs> that's because they wanted you to buy the kit separate. Oh, of course they did. So that would go on there. You should have some kind of a locking device on here, like at least a lock washer. I came unprepared yet again. You were very unprepared. And that one doesn't even want to go in the hole. No. You've already screwed that one up. There we go. Screws are not very Pretty long. Pretty short. Yeah. They still need lock washers on there. And they're stupid Allen heads. So there's plenty of room to go through these without hurting anything. So these two would work good on the top, but you need two more on the bottom. <coughs> so where's your screws that are longer than these? I got some at home. How long are they? Um, probably inch and a half. That might be too long. I can cut them. You got something between an inch and a half and this? No. No? Well, that's not a good sign. Yeah, hold on to that. Alright, so now we need some, need some other stuff. See, he should be digging through this box right here. And you find a whole bunch in there, I'm sure. But I'm lazy, so I'm going to go over here. Look through this box. Crap. A drawer full of crap. Find something that looks a little better. Those would work. There's some butthead Allens. Butthead Allen? Butthead Allens. They're for butthead people. Oh, like me? I hate those things. There, you're in charge of that. Well, you got my flashlight on. Are you fixing the Christie again? No, I turned it off. <clears throat> oh, wow. They have hardware kits that you put on these bikes that are supposed to be fused. Fused? Used. Oh, used. Used and abused. You just pay a little extra money for hardware that works, and then you don't have to tear your motor apart after you suck this whole hardware into it. Uh huh. But we know how you are. By now. now. If you put that on there, it'll run better. Yeah, you said that before. That's right. But I don't think you wanted to sell that to me. Uh, right now, you have to modify it. You have to cut it out to put the air cleaner on it. You have to put in the middle machine and cut out a notch for it to sit on there. And then it works good. Hmm. I used those before. It works good. Where's your hardware out there, Bob? There's a gasket, isn't it? Stinker. Some of the stuff you can't buy anymore. They keep obsoleting parts every time you buy them from one place. And you go, oop, we don't have no more. Can't mm. buy them. <clears throat> and then people come to find you. So there's a lock tab. Oh, wow. I would not have had those. Yeah, I know you didn't have them on the body film the problem. I wouldn't have been able to find those at any hardware store either. There's some new tape on the full bolts. Oh, I wanted to ask you. No, I didn't do it. 
<laughs> you know the um, idle adjuster screw that's on the throttle plate thingy? See, here's the correct hardware, see? Uh, yeah, you can really torque those down. You strip them out really good too. Mm -hmm. Now this is the early one that does that takes the J slot air cleaner so he doesn't have a two pieces like this. I don't have the J slot though. So here's the two piece one too. So you take this one here. That See, that makes it like a velocity stack. It runs a lot better. Yeah, it'll flow way better, right? And then your stupid Allen would fit in there too, so... Okay. Um, Put the rest of your parts up. They're uh, right here. <laughs> Bless you. Well, not that the air cream like that scratches it, remember? I didn't put it there. I sure didn't do it. <laughs> oh, you're putting it inside of that? It goes like that. See, it makes it run better. Air oh, air. I thought it went outside. Just plain. Well, you can put it right there like that. That's how it's made to go, but if you want to make it work inside your earth, maybe. Oh, my. How, well, put it in there. I might not be able to afford that thing. Where's your lever at? Your uh, bracket right here. Well, we have to modify this to make it fit. Oh, boy. Because it didn't fit right now. They didn't make it for this application for some reason. So you mean cut it on the you underside? It. You have to cut it. Yes. All right. All right. We'll be back.